Welcome to the Edge. This is certifiably the greenest office building in the world. But that just might be the least interesting part about it, because the Edge in Amsterdam is also possibly the most connected office space in the world. Working at the Edge is insane. It all starts with a smartphone app developed by the building's main tenant, the consulting firm Deloitte. When you arrive at the Edge, a camera recognizes you by your license plate for automatic access. And because it's the Netherlands, there are charters available for electric cars. Inside, things start to get interesting because you don't have a desk. No one here does. Workspaces are assigned to you based on your schedule for the day. You have options. A work booth, a meeting room, what they call a concentration room, a sitting desk, a standing desk, a balcony desk. You can even just hang out in the sun-filled atrium all day. This concept is called hot desking, and it's what allows Deloitte to have 2,500 workers, but less than half as many desks at its Dutch headquarters. The app knows your preferences, and when you arrive at your workspace, the lights dim or brighten based on your stored settings. And any of the building's massive flat screens can be instantly paired with an iPhone or a laptop. So what makes all this possible? The LED light panels developed by Philips specifically for the Edge are actually powered by low voltage ethernet cables which means every light in the building becomes its own internet-connected data hub with 28,000 sensors that makes the building and its users smarter. The building becomes a very important part of who we are and what we want to be, and we actually have seen in recruitment that more people are now spontaneously coming to Deloitte because they want to work in this building. We uh, are planning to build a lot more buildings like these, and the next one will be smarter, and the one after that will be smarter as well. And we won't stop until all cities in the world are filled with buildings that are intelligent and that are not using any energy anymore. In the end, we will actually need less buildings in the world, but the buildings that are there will be used in a better way, will be more efficient, and will be, uh, will be using a lot less energy than in the past. 